hello friends you are welcome this is soft reason in this presentation we will be exporting this three dimension spiral ramp from AutoCAD to Revit architecture and so let us start at first I will want you to save this and give it a name just as I've saved mine as RAM right in my document. So I will go straight away to launch Revit. Yeah, it's Revit. I want to be opening a new family by clicking on the new here. Click right there. Okay, so in this provision, I will go straight away to English. Double click right there, and then in the template for family, I will scroll down and I will be considering a metric, metric generic model. This one, select right there and click on open. We give this program some seconds to open the family. All right, so we are good to go now. At this point, I want to go straight away. To the insert tab, click right there, and then come all the way to import card. Click on that. This will navigate you to your document where you save the RAM. So I will scroll down and then I'll pick the RAM, this one. Then go straight away here, auto center to center. Click on open. Give the progress of seconds. In this dialog, click on closed as we take the progress of seconds to import that which that is done successfully now the spiral RAM has been imported to Revit successfully zoom it out in just like that and here is the spiral RAM if you go straight away to 3D click right there and you will be having the spiral RAM just like this and you can rotate it okay the way it is now it is not editable for you to make it editable you need to explode that all right so selecting it just like this come straight away to import instances all right then on that explode click right there then full explode click on that all right you can see this has been explored successfully okay so you can run an editing or do any adjustment that you need to do on this all right so this is how to import and autocad three dimension drawing to revit architecture and subsequently we will be editing this to form something of this kind that i'm going to show you now if i should go to file and then i click on open family it will take me to this provision this is not where I wanted to go. Go back there. Click on this close button. It's asking me to save change to the family. So I'll click on yes. And then I'll give the family a name as family 2. I'll save that. This will take me to this interface. What I want to show you is this car park floor. I'll click on that. It is a family. Right? So I will be showing us in the subsequent lesson how to actually create this. This is a family. You can create it and then load it into your project. Right? So I want to bring the lesson to a stop here. Stay tuned for more advanced lesson and bye for now.